What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. This is Brian and today I have this new camera that I bought like three months ago and it cost me like around $23 but with the shipment and everything it cost me like $43. The reason why I bought this camera was because I wanted to stop opening the little door to get access to my Kodiak generator to check how how much battery I had in in the Kodiak and I have it in a different compartment I'll show you later right now we're gonna open it and this is what we have this is in Chinese but also you get it in English and and see what we have here this is the camera it's uh, super small you can actually put like a like a a little SD card you have to download the application and for this little camera and then you can actually see whatever wherever you put this you can see it on your on your on your cell phone so we're gonna try it right now and uh, let's start we have the USB cable we also have like a little magnet I think you can Put this BHB tape in there. You glue it here, and if you're gonna, if you have like a, a little metallic surface where you're gonna put it, that's cool. Oh well, actually, I think you don't even need the the uh, this because I can feel that is it. I don't like it glues itself. Like that's that's cool. We have this. Oh, okay. So now I, I'm starting to understand what's going on here. I think it's something like this. Oh, that's pretty cool, actually. That's super cool. I thought it was gonna be the, just the camera. Okay, so you have uh, some more BHB tape, and right now I don't really know how it works, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna try to read the manual. Okay, so I'm gonna charge the the little camera right now, but also I want to take the time now that it's charging to show you what I have to do every time I. I want to check how much electricity I have left on my Kodiak solo generator. Now, I'm going to grab one of these right here. Okay, so this is my little shelf where I have like coffee and, and you know vitamins and stuff. I'll show it to you later. I have to move it. Then I have to try to fit inside the thing. Like this little room. I have to sit and then go here then I just to check how much electricity I have left but the idea with the camera is that I'm gonna I'm gonna put it over here so that way every time I connect the camera through Wi-Fi I can actually check how much electricity I have left and that's something real simple I shouldn't have to be doing all this all this thing I hate to put it back because sometimes you know it this happens and then it gets stuck and then I have to, to put more effort in it it's not that I'm lazy but I'm trying to make my life a little bit easier and that's why that's the uh, all the purpose of technology all right, so as I was saying, every time I, ha I, I have to, I want to check the, the voltage of my Kodiak solar generator, I have to do all this mess. And I don't want to do it anymore. So the camera should be the solution for this uh, little, you know, mess that I have to do every time I want to check that. We're going to, we're going to see how it works. Other thing I want to tell you is that I've been, I've been using my solar, my Kodiak solar generator for the last six months and or a little bit more probably six months and a half and it's been working perfect i don't have any complaints about it and anything 
Um, right now it's really it's cloudy, and the, the sun is not is definitely it's not coming it's not coming out today. And but my solar panels, um, I have four solar panels now, 100 watt solar panels, and you know I've been charging my my, my generator a little bit faster. Uh, so it's been working perfect. It's been working super good. Now in uh, this call, last couple of days, I've, I've been I have to use my my generator, my gas generator, to uh, to charge my my Kodiak because I also have you know to power my refrigerator and I can't let all my my stuff in there to go bad. So I've been I had to use my 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 generator. Once, but that's not a that's not a review about the Kodiak right now. I'll actually make another review about about everything that I've been, you know, all the upgrades that I've done to the to my solar uh, system. But right now we're gonna wait for the for the camera to charge a little bit more, and uh, I'll be right back. So I'm gonna turn it on. Uh, you're supposed to press to hold the button like for two seconds. So I'll go to my to my um, Wi-Fi option. You can see that it's connecting. I'm not connecting the camera through router, so I'm just connecting the cell phone to the camera. So I go to the application, and uh, it says online. I go and connect this. I can see everything from my cell phone and actually the image is really it's really clear um, let's see that's Elisa what's up babe yeah. and uh, actually you have some other options here which gonna we're gonna try to zoom right now now that we have that we have it here um, let's see what this one does Oh, cool! So you have um, audio. That's cool. So we have audio, and I didn't know that. Oh, let me see what this one does. Hello? 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 I don't know, but it 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 has audio. Now this is like a spy cam. It is designed to, you know, spy people and stuff. But I'm not gonna use it for that. I'm just gonna turn this off. I'm gonna use it for my whatever I told you already. So we're gonna connect this right now, and we're gonna see how it works. This right here is the little, uh, my little setup for the camera. The the one that's gonna be in the Kodiak. I've put. Uh, BHB tape or double-sided ta tape here because this is the distance that the camera needs in order to to be able to read the numbers and the little dots of power that the, the, the Kodiak shows so we're gonna try it right now and I hope this time it works oh yeah I came from work I want to chill right now but first I want to see how much electricity I have left on my Kodiak I don't have to make a big mess because I already have an application for that. And it's in the chill room. I'm gonna go to my wi to my Wi-Fi and connect to the camera. And it says online. Oh, let me see how much electricity I have. Sha. And I have 10.26 volts, and I'm using 40. Point something uh, watts. And I have like four dots, and the other one is dying. But yes. So this is a successful uh, project right here. It's good enough. It's fair enough for me. I can see how much I'm using. I can see the voltage that I have left, and I have. I can see the dots, which it calms my mind that I have uh, like four dots. I know that it lasts me, uh, you know, probably through the night. So guys thanks for watching shoot your comments uh, let me know how, how how it went I mean if you liked it if there's any other video that you probably want me to, to do uh, or if you want me to try something else here inside the camper that's the, that's the point of this if you like the 
the video also and if you want to keep watching more of these videos uh, I would appreciate if you subscribe to my channel uh, also give it a like and um, I'll try to make the, uh, the next video about the Kodiak and see how uh, and show you guys everything about uh, all the upgrades that I've done to the solar system and also to the camper because I've done a couple of them and it's always a pleasure guys to share videos with you and stay tuned for the next video I appreciate your time y'all have a great day oh let me check how much I have in my voltage